Hey, a while back I was tagged to do a Q&A video. I've been putting it off. But one of the questions in the list of 10 was, what was your worst garden disaster or failure? Today, not only will I tell you about it, but I'll show you. These are Creole onions that I planted back in October. Uh, if you've been watching my videos, you've seen that I, I start my seeds in the fall and sometime around February, first part of March, I'll transplant them, space them out, giving them room to grow. Well, last October, I decided to plant two different varieties. One was my usual candies, and the other was red Creole. The candies, totally my fault. I used old seeds. Even though I planted probably a thousand seeds, I had one to come up. Good lesson, use fresh seed. The red Creole came up and grew just fine. They were beautiful. But when it was almost time to transplant, they started bolting, which is not good for onions, bulb onions at least. Once that happens, once they bolt, the plants are no longer interested in making a bulb. They just want to produce seed to reproduce. When your onions start bolting, the best thing to do is yank them up. Get them out of the ground because you're just wasting your time. You can salvage some of that by pulling them up, cutting the roots off, cutting the stem a few inches from the little bulb that, you, that you've got, and then taking it inside and chopping it up, putting it in the freezer and using it as onions. When something like that happens, no matter what it is, the first thing you need to do is stop and think. What did you do differently from the previous years? What could have caused this? First thing that came to mind was last October, or really close to the end of September, that's when I planted my seeds, which was about two, maybe three weeks earlier than I usually do. Could that have been it? Don't know. The second thing that came to mind was the weather. Down here in Louisiana, we got a very, very mild winter. In fact, I had volunteer tomatoes coming up in January in the raised bed. In fact, one of them that I have planted now is one of those transplants. One thing that does make me feel a little bit better is I read on the forum where a couple of other people had the exact same problem with their red creoles. Their, the other onions they planted we're doing pretty good, but the red Creoles took a hit. If you've had a similar experience with red Creoles, or really any other onion, let me know. And what you believe the problem could be for onions bolting so early. Well, I hope it was helpful and wash pop.